Right, okay, so the R8. Obviously, it had the rap. We made the whole video on the rap. You guys, you, I, the reaction was actually much more positive than I thought because I wasn't sure if you guys would like it or not. But it went straight to a shop to have its windows tinted and a few other details done. And now we're finally going to be able to pick it up and drive it around with the new wrap, which I think is going to be pretty insane. I'm excited to see people's reactions and stuff. So, thought I'd bring you along. We're currently at home, but we need to switch cars around all over the place to be able to go get the R8. Right, it's a bit hectic. We need to take the Twizy to go get the Mercedes to go pick up the R8 and then drop the Mercedes off and bring the R8 back. It's all very confusing because I don't have enough spaces in this garage for the cars, but we're getting there. Right, we're now in the Mercedes. The Mercedes C220 diesel. My parents' car, um, which they very kindly actually lent me when I need four seats. And uh, so I recently cleaned it all up for them and stuff. So it's got a full tank. So we figured we'd take this to go over to Italy. Seem more economical and less extravagant than taking the Ferrari. And also, we need to pack it full of some stuff, which is going to be a little bit of a surprise for my parents soon. As a thank you for letting me use this car. I actually hope they're not watching this video because they might already. Then that kind of ruins. Oh, well. Thank you. Si, si, introdurre il biglietto. Ritirare la tessera. Ritirare la tessera. Oh, si, grazie, tutto bene. Ciao, ciao. A Ventimiglia. Welcome to Italy. Italy, which is actually only like a 15 minute drive from Monaco. Although, even though it is only a 15 minute drive, it does feel quite different. I really like it here. Beautiful, roads are actually quite good here. Food is incredible. And my R8 is hiding around somewhere. Money work. El mundo quiere dinero. Right, so just picked up the R8 from the shop and there are a few changes. I just wanted to simply walk you through them. Uh, first of which is this black line here. I don't know if you noticed on the last video of the wrap, uh, there was actually a gold line that, well, gold, bronze, this kind of color, um, round back. And the initial thought was it would kind of go with the plate, but it just looked odd. So we put black over that now because it looks just much cleaner, much nicer like this. I also tinted the, the rear lights. Now it's not like a fully blacked out tint, but pretty close and just makes the rear look so much more aggressive. I did the same round front, um, which actually changes even more the look of the car when you see it around front. See, look like that. I mean, it's so aggressive. I really, really like that. That was a must do and I'm so happy with how it came out. The next must do are the wheels. I need to change these to black, really sporty rims. So that's like next on the list, 100%. I know you guys are going to comment about that. I then want to maybe put some canards around front. We were just talking about that. That could be quite cool. Tinting the windows and then somehow finding a way to put a wing on. I don't want to drill holes in the original pieces. And now that we've wrapped it, I don't want to necessarily buy a whole other piece and then put a wing on that. So we're talking about solutions for a wing. If possible, I'll do it. If not, I think it still looks pretty clean like that and you can still raise that one. And last thing is actually Zenrage who are the guys who make my exhaust system that I've got on this, which you can kind of see through there, are sending me carbon fiber exhaust tips. So those will be super cool when they arrive. But yeah, I mean, it's coming together. The vision is coming together. There are changes. I know the rims. I know a bunch of you are going to comment. There are still changes to be done, but the vision, well, we're nearly there. Now I just want to drive it. I've been wanting to drive this around town to see people's reactions, see if I bump into any subscribers and just generally experiencing this new look on the car. So let's go do that now. Right, let's see people's reactions because it is quite a wacky wrap. The first reaction I have is this uh, sun thing. I don't know how you call it. But oh, hey, Cole. Oh, yeah. Looks like Cole's car. <laughs> yeah, it's the same. Oh, there's so many people in town. Yeah, people definitely, uh, definitely stare at it. So the first reaction is 
that that's made the visibility a lot uh, a lot lower. This bike was amazing. Did you see that guy lift the sunglasses yeah. up? Like what? The I hell? have. Yeah. The only other issue is the aircon still not working, so I need to take it to Audi. I feel like they spend more time in in the shop than they do. At mine, and now we've had all the lights done. Get it back. Aircon's not working, so I need to figure that out still because it's now 30.5 degrees. It's so safe to say without aircon, it's a little bit steamy. <laughs> I mean, you're not going anywhere discreetly with this car, right? Let's see. I mean, you do feel like you're in a fishbowl a little bit. Yeah. People. That's why we need tinted windows on this, so you can just put the windows up and you're good to go. Yep. You know the people who also like, they clearly notice your car, but they're like, I'm not gonna give them the pleasure of looking at it. So they walk past, so obviously kind of dying to have a little peek, but they just walk like, no, nope, I'm a team, I'm a team, don't care. I'm a team. <laughs> yeah, if you had a star for every person who yeah. looks, look ready. Ding, ding. I mean, the aim of the game was not to make a, a rap that everyone would look at. The aim of the game was to do a rap to please the audience happens to be a rap that everyone looks at. Oh, F8 Tributo, Spider. Very nice. Oh, cameras. I don't think anyone's noticed. Oh, Oop. there he is. Yep, yep, yep. Cameras, cameras, cameras. Oh, wait, yeah, it's not the most discreet of raps. It feels good to have this car back. Yep. For probably about two days before it needs to go to the shop. <laughs> okay, police now. I thought the police was going to stop us. Yeah. F1 tunnel. There's so many pedestrians in this tunnel. I see so many people coming to Monaco and wanting to pin it down the F1 tunnel. So dangerous because there's so many pedestrians walking around. I have to admit it's tempting. But better safe than sorry. Around the F1 track. By accident, we've maybe uh, created like a marketing billboard that's just gonna dry around. We should just park this thing up, put a GoPro on it, and see how many photos people take. We may or may not have forgotten to do an outro. Just realized whilst editing this video. Apologies. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you enjoyed driving around with the R8. This weekend, I'm actually taking it out to its first car event with the new wrap. So I'm super excited, super pumped. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe if you aren't already. And uh, I guess that's it. This is an outro. That works as an outro, right? Yep. Yeah, that works. Yep. Cheers, guys. Bye-bye.